So guys, there are lift and slide systems. These are large sliders and there is Providel. This is a product of poor quality, one glass, not very high quality, some small sliders for balconies. And some intermediate options are not available, while few systems are represented. So I want to tell you about sliding systems that are between Providel and a lift and slide system, like Alutec or Krauss. These are lightweight sliders that can be with one glass or with a single chambered glass unit. They have profiles along the perimeter and they just move like this, a very cool solution. The advantage is that it's airtight, the corners are neatly joined at 45 degrees, it may be with a glass unit, maybe even with a small thermal bridge. Cold with a small thermal bridge can be of great height, up to 3.5, even up to 4 meters. They can be integrated into a winter garden. They can be separately standing like summer houses. So it's a very cool system, be sure to watch it to the end. So what options there are for such systems? We have some in the showroom. Here's the first one. This is a slider. There's such a small handle. Click. It moves like this. I mean, you can see it, right? There's a single chamber small glass unit installed. It's an economy system designed for minimum sizes because here the glass unit is maximum, which one, Suleiman? 494? 494, 494. That is a very small glass unit, you know? This is what these profiles look like. Here we have a round handle along the whole length and it's convenient. Well, it's really convenient to move it, to grab this handle. It can be on one side or it can be on both sides, see? And this is where either the glass or the glass unit is inserted, but the glass is very thin. 494, yes. I don't know if they make them elsewhere or not, but it's clear that you cannot make such a glass unit in a large size. So the profiles are thin and the glass unit is thin as well. And the maximum height of such a slider is 2.5 meters, right? Or maybe 3. Well, here we did 3 meters, 2.8, 3 meters maximum. So it's a slider. Here it has guides. The guides can have a high threshold and can have a low threshold like this. But why make it high? And I think low is better, or not. This is so because if we do balconies, a balcony in a house, a high threshold is better. And we make a low threshold when people pass by often. For example here, if people pass by often, it is for cafes, restaurants, people often go there so that they don't hit it every time. For this purpose, we make a low threshold. It is very convenient and, for example, on parking lots or where cars are washed, in such places we also make such a system. The cars here drive through, they don't hit it, I mean, it's very convenient, they are rigid. How many, there's four, four rails, yeah. I mean, there can be four sashes here at most. Three sliding, one dump, right? No, they're all sliding. Really? Yeah, they all slide open. And they can go one way or the other. They can open to either side. And the other thing that's good here is that you can do six sashes or you can do eight sashes. Eight? How's that? Yeah, look. So, it's four one way and four the other way. So, we have the middle opened. 4 in one way and 4 in the other, yes. So you can make 8 sashes on this frame, yes. But that's the way it is in this system, right? There are systems of other manufacturers in Turkey which have, for example, an aluminum guide here. And there are also steel ones, as far as I know. These are filled with steel bars. Steel ones are considered a bit more reliable, no paint rubbing off, right? The paint can wear off on these over time. Well, first of all, I would like to say that when we make a low threshold, we don't paint it. It has its own aluminum color. We leave it that way. So, you either don't paint the threshold, or paint it, and accept the fact that you will have paint coming off on the top here over time. Or ask me to bring a system that has these stainless bars that will protect the guide from rubbing off. Anyway, there are different options. So, we told about the cheap sliding system, 
and there is a system that is already a class higher. It is also called without a thermal bridge, but it gives the possibility to install a thicker glass unit. So we have more opportunities. We can already put 6 mm glass with a big height. And it's also more powerful, that is, the profiles are more able to absorb wind loads with such reinforcements inside. Oh, I didn't mention the locks, right? So there's a handle, fittings. Here are the rods. It's a more elaborate system. You just move the handle and everything is locked by the rods. And in that cheap one, look, here. There's only this latch, up and down, and that's it. I mean, it's like Providel. You slide the sash, you lock the latch. In other words, it's a cheap option and one locking point. And here we have several locking points in height. You see, when you move the handle, the hooks move. So in this version, here we see four locking points in height. More airtight and more reliable. And I think it's more comfortable, of course. I obviously like this slider more. So, how high can it be? Here, 3.5, 3.6 is the maximum height you can do. And the stiffening rib that we showed, it stands on both sides. Not only inside, but also outside. The same profile. So, when it's high, not that high, but even if it's 3.5 meters, it will not wobble much, because there are stiffening ribs. Well, of course, we have two ribs, one here and one there, and the profile is about 100 millimeters deep, and it can withstand a large wind load. It's rigid, which is what we need for a height of 4 meters. So, what else can I say? Of course, here the filling is 20 millimeters, but as I said, there are systems that can be with a 24 millimeter glass unit. Also, it may be with a thermal bridge. So I select the system according to your needs. So you contact me and say, I need it to be of this size. I need it to be warm with a single chamber glass unit. We select the technical solution. If you need a small one with one glass, it's different. That is, we select the system and the technical solution according to your needs. Suleiman also helps me with this. I know some suppliers too. So contact us and we will bring you such a system. Delivery is carried out as with guillotines, that is, we order it without glass. The glass is made afterwards. This system is ordered not as profiles, but already in a finished form, in a constructor, at a Turkish factory. We tell the size, they will cut it, paint it, make all the holes, because it is possible to manufacture these systems in our production, of course, but there are a lot of nuances, all sorts of milling, how to make them correctly. They have their own press dies here, and it is inconvenient to mill by hand. It is necessary to make holes, to make certain cutouts for fastening. That is why I am in favor of making the workpiece here. In the constructor, it is all packed very securely. It comes to your country. I can deliver the product anywhere in the world, wherever you live. I select different systems in Turkey and send them to you. There we buy a glass unit and install it. That is, I can install it for you or you can install it yourself and even buy the glass unit yourself if you wish. There is also a low threshold, a high threshold of course. Here the high threshold is bigger than this one. Here the total thickness of the system is 13 centimeters, while on the simple system the thickness is 11 centimeters. Here, the structure itself is heavy too. The thickness of the aluminum is greater, and the structure itself is heavier. The system here is wider than the usual simple system. Here, the handle can also be made with a key. When we close it with a key, and it's secure. Well, of course, if you want to enter from the outside, then you put a handle on both sides and a key and you can turn the key from the outside and enter yes and if you don't want to get in from the outside you put the handle only inside and if you lock it inside you can't get in from the outside so we talked about sliders and i will also make other videos on other factories about similar sliding systems but the topic in my opinion is very relevant for our market because customers constantly tell me 
Lift and slide systems are too expensive, and Providel is too poor quality, it's not suitable at all. They want some kind of middle option and now it is possible to get this middle option. It is actually inexpensive, it is high quality, it is possible to make large heights of both cold and warm systems and with a glass unit. So be sure to give this video a like. There will be my contacts in the description. That's it, bye everybody.